Do you consider yourself militant? <laughs> I consider myself Malcolm. <laughs> Actually, it's a form of 20th century slavery. And what you and I have to let the man know is we are peaceful people. We are loving people. We love everybody who loves us. But we don't love anybody who doesn't love us. We're nonviolent with people who are nonviolent with us. He was schooled in Oakland, where he now lives. His first book was called To Die for the People, and imminently he will publish his autobiography, which is called Revolutionary Suicide. A concept I shall now ask Mr. Newton, please to explain. Uh, I'll explain it, uh, but if I may impose upon you, uh, I have a friend who's uh, almost dying for me to ask this question. Um, if you will. Um, the question is, uh, during the revolution of 1776, when uh, the United States of America broke away from England, uh, my friend would like to know, what side would you have been on during that time? 